an Apple III monitor. So cool. This one I'm definitely going to let dry out before I turn it on. I just remembered I never tried turning this on. And that should be a nice little green screen monitor if I recall right. Somebody cut the cord whenever they were at the electronics recycling center. I actually made a bit of an annoyance of myself because that was already shipped, like wrapped in the uh, the pallet, and I was like, please get it out, get it out, and they're like, fine, get it out. And so they, they cut the, the wrap. Now thankfully, the southern mechanic has sent me a bunch of power cables, which I plan to do a video about his uh, stuff in an inbox video. I kind of want to couple that with a lathe video, but uh, just a sneak peek. Southern Mechanic on YouTube. It's kind of cool. And he said, oh, you should have sent a shirt too. He'll get two shout outs because I've been neglecting it. I should have done this months ago, but uh, I'm focused on other stuff. So, that one has a ground pin, so let's see about getting one out of the ground. Actually, oh, these ones with that ground. They're like, oh, wow, that one's actually useful. I can use that. Okay. Oh, rain. And now you guys are going to see how much of a mess the workshop is in at the moment. These gloves are from 1983, so it's probably the same year this was made. Oh, I hear it. Okay, well, promising. Look at that! Oh my god! It's so cool! It's so cool! Uh -huh. I can't believe that actually works from the trash. Well, we need some video signal. That's some good military surplus stuff. It's hard to find that stuff anymore. And now that has the knot in there, so it can't be pulled out. It looks like this has had some moisture. Like maybe it flooded. And the dust came up in there. Yeah. Yeah, that's not dust, that's dirt. Turning to mud. Oh, yeah, that's, 
That is mud. It must have come up through the bottom. So this is probably sitting outside for a while. Wouldn't be surprised. all that mud. Okay, well. You know, I seem to recall I didn't start it up because it was so wet. I wanted to let it dry. Well, that's a good example of why you should let something dry out for half a year. Or a year. However long. Oh yeah, a year. I had it dry enough for a year. And now it works. Now that is pretty cool. Why is it about adding an audio circuit? The dithering is really interesting. It is like a a dot matrix. It's so weird. There's a little bit of ghosting on there too. Starting to smell old electronic smell. Look at that ghosting, that's, or the, the, the trailing, that's, that's pretty cool. So after all this time, turns out it works. I am so happy. That's awesome. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and thank you very much for watching. See ya.